Carmex is made in Wisconsin, but its products are sold around the globe. And they're currently in 19 different countries. And it's not only their famous lip balm they sell. Emily Deem spent some time at Karma Labs in Franklin and shows us many other products created there. Paul Welbing is here with me, the third generation running this business. Paul, we want to show people where you started and where you are today. You've created a lot of new products with the Carmex name brand on it. Let's show everyone about some of the products over here and work our way down. So starting on the left is our original jar, which is the yellow cap, our red flag on it. The original was sold just on a countertop. Then we moved into blister carding, which is retail is preferred way from doing things now. The tube came along in about 1987, which starts with the original formula. A little bit of mineral oil is added to thin it out, make it a little smoother, a little glossier, easier to expel. From there, we came out with the sticks, which is the original formula, with a little bit of a botanical wax to raise the melting temperature. After that, we came out with Moisture Plus, which is our first product designed specifically for women. The slim, more cosmetic looking tube uh, angled tip on it, uh, colors we introduce also. We have a, a peach, a plum, a berry, and a uh, uh, pink in that. From there, we moved into skincare. Customers wrote and they would say, I'm using Carmex in my hands. I really, my really, really chapped hands. Uh, it, it works well. I don't like grease in my hands. So I asked our chemist, could you emulsify it, make it feel less greasy? They came up with a way of emulsifying Carmex, which means adding water to it, combining it at a molecular level, uh, such that you have the action-packed grease in the Carmex, but you can touch a suede jacket or mirror and not be the spot. From uh, the cream, we went to a lotion, which has vitamin E and aloe vera, a little thinner all over, to flavors, which uh, pomegranate is our newest flavor, yeah. and it's the one I carry in my pocket now. Uh, we do alignment and mint. Um, one of our retailers asked us, could we do a packaging specifically for areas where they have stores in high touristy areas? So right now, we just came out with Las Vegas, New York, and Chicago. Um, I believe we're going to be also doing Houston, San Francisco, and Miami. These have not even hit the stores, but these are brand new. 